Hello everyone and welcome back to Mossley Farm and we are here with the Queen of Sauce once again on a beautiful spring day and she is teaching us the complete breakfast and I have actually heard this is a really great food to know if you need like a lot of energy, a big boost especially to your farming. So complete breakfast. Last week I taught you how to make hash browns. This week I'll show you how to combine them with the other ingredients to create a hearty complete breakfast. This meal will really fill you up and give you the energy you need to get in a hard day's work. And so we learned how to make that today, and I'm really curious. So here's the hash browns. I need oil and potatoes in order to get hash browns. And then the complete breakfast. Where is that? I want to know. Because I've heard rumor. Ah, oh, there it is. Complete breakfast. 50 max energy increase. Then you get 200 energy, 80 health, and 2 farming. Ready to take on the world. So that is like pancakes. That's fried egg. That's hash browns. That's kind of an expensive thing to make. Oh my gosh. I'm not sure if that's like the best or not because that's really really pricey all right well we're just gonna pop some of these things in here yesterday we got a new task from mr quee the mysterious mr quee oh what's this meet me at the docks on a sunny morning i've got something in mind elliot no elliot we already did this and i turned you down i don't know how to do this oh what's this Hi, how are you doing? I hope you enjoy the gift I've sent you. Well, goodbye. From Emily. Oh, she gave me some cloth. Oh my gosh, what's this? Notice, Pierre here. I really, really want a plate of sashimi. I'll play, pay top coin to whoever brings me some from Pierre. Okay, wow. There's a lot going on all of a sudden. And Elliot appears to think that we're going to be in love with him. That's not the case. I think we need to go and take a... Oh, there's Leia. She's at 10 hearts with us. <gasps> Let's go and see if we can visit her today. And we're going to go see if we can maybe get the message across to her over how we feel. Hopefully we'll be able to pull that off. Oh, some dandelions grew in our little garden over here. <gasps> Look, we have the mixed seeds. Yay. I get so excited when we get to harvest these up. We can save the leeks and give them to George. So, oh gosh, and there's so many potatoes over here too. <gasps> what a day. Do I have potato seeds? No, I don't. Yes, I do. There they are. All right. Well, let's get these potato seeds planted. This is for fall. Um... Six days. Yeah, there's just enough time to get the potato seeds planted. I'm glad I decided to double check that like at the last second. I was like, wait a second, Siri. Isn't it almost the end of the season? <gasps> you should double check that. All right. And then we might make some more of the... Oh, look at this. Oh, yeah. We might make some more... No, don't eat the potato. No, don't eat the potato. I must have an almost full inventory then. We might go ahead and make some more of the spring seeds then. All right, let's get more potato seeds going. And let's ship some potatoes. And I'm going to go ahead and ship the high quality stuff. Just because I think that that's a good thing to do. Uh, maybe not the horseradishes though. Because uh, Krobus actually likes the horseradishes. And nope, not that daffodil. I need to go ahead and make more spring seeds before I do that. There we go. One thing of spring seeds. What am I missing? Oh, a dandelion. All right, let's go see if I can get another dandelion really quick. Yeah, there's a dandelion. And here's more potatoes too. Wonderful. Man, we're keeping ourselves so busy this spring. And I have so much money. Yeah, we'll have to go ahead and we will go visit uh, the lady with the pig today. Nope, nope, nope. Don't eat that wild horseradish. Pick this one up. There we go. Oh, inventory is full. Inventory is still full. Nope, inventory is still full. All right, so I need to go ahead and make some room. My gosh, there's so much stuff. Maybe I should ship these horseradishes. There's so many of them. All right, really quickly, let's go ahead and make some more. Let's see, where are they? Make some more spring seeds. I think I might make a couple piles of them, like so. Just so that I know I've got plenty for the ones I need. And then I'll ship these. And now I can go ahead and ship the dandelions. I can ship the cola too. And I'll keep the leeks because we're going to give those leeks to George as a gift. Also, let's go ahead and grab this torch and put these newspapers in. There we go. I don't really need torches. I could probably start using them to like decorate around my farm though. All right, and let's make some more potato seeds. Potatoes are absolutely amazing. I really love them. And I also need to water this little spot. So yeah, we'll go visit with the lady with the pig, to, the lady with the pig today. I don't want to visit Elliot because I think he's going to want to talk about maybe having a relationship again. And I tried to be really gentle in letting him down last time. So this is going to be awkward having him up at 10 hearts. So hopefully what can happen is by getting married. And I'm thinking I still want a spring wedding. We just have to have Leia's last event. And I'm going to decide between either marrying Leia or marrying Abigail. And I'm very excited about either one. All right. Ooh, there's more potatoes ready to harvest down here. 
But yeah, we just need to go ahead and have like the last event with him and then I sh or her and then I should be able to make a clear decision between the two. And I think it's leaning towards Abigail. I'm not going to mince words. I'm not going to pretend things aren't what they are uh, and maybe lead anybody on. So yeah, I'm just gonna have to be very clear about that. Okay, watch out chicken. I'll give you a little pat. Oh gosh, I've got so much stuff going on. All right, let's go ahead and harvest these up. Plop these in there. Maybe I should make some like horseradish, uh, horseradish jam or something. All right, maybe pickle up some of these these green beans. I guess I'll make some pickled green beans in just a minute here. Oh gosh. Well, at least the day is actually not going by as quickly as I fear. I always see like how fast the day goes by and I'm like, oh no, oh no, what am I gonna do? Oh, and I forgot I have all this like, oh gosh, there's stuff going on over here already again. I forgot I have all those wines that I can buy and, or all those wines to sell. Man, I am going to be so rich. I'm going to just be rolling in the money. What am I going to do with all this money, Rose Stone? I don't even know. I'm so glad I don't have more fields or else I would like just spend my entire time in the fields every day. Jeez. All right, Rose Stone, we're almost done with these potatoes. Jeez Louise. All right, more potatoes. And let's come on down. How many more potato spots do I have? Not many. Let's water these two little spots. There's my little dinosaurs. And I've been giving presents to everybody. So today could potentially be another present day. But I need to go and get my pick from... need to go get my pick from Clint. Oh, chickens. There's just so much going on. Oh, gosh. All right, back and forth we go with the potatoes. All right, there we go. That should be enough. That should be the last of the potato seeds I can plant in my empty fields. And this is a good day to do it though. Oh gosh, actually there's plenty of room for more. <laughs> no, this is a good day to do it though. Oh, we got mixed seeds. Well, oops, because, um, oh wow, that's four mixed seeds. That's a lot of seeds. Yeah, this is a good day to go ahead and plant everything. Since it's still early enough in the season, we might get a harvest or two out of it. All right, there we go. There, that's all done. Yay, chicken. Sweet pea, I'm so happy. That's finally finished. Now I can come up and get to work on doing some other things, like gathering up these blueberry jams and I guess making some pickles. So we'll see how that goes. And then we'll come on over here and I'm going to get some more coal made because I want to be able to spend some awesome time down in the mines. No, that's not what I wanted to do. I don't think so, at least. Nope, not what I wanted to do. All right, there's that, that, that. We'll peek in here for anything. Nothing from my fruit bats right now, which is totally fine. Oh gosh, I guess I have to peek inside my greenhouse real quick. Hi, little guys. All right, greenhouse. Greenhouse is good. Don't really need to plant anything right now. Don't really have anything to plant, so I should probably work on that, but still. All right, we'll come over here. Pat, pat. Oh, look at everything. There's just butterflies all over the place. It's so pretty. Butterflies and dragons everywhere. All right, there we go. And I've got a cheese for Leia then. And let's gather up all of these wines. Spiceberry, grape, blackberry, wine, lots of different kinds of wines. And we're going to just fill this whole thing up with strawberries. So we'll have a lot of strawberry wine coming on in. So there's that. All right. And let's, oops, I need to milk everybody. Oh, geez. And there's a ton of, a ton of cherries and a ton of apricots to harvest too. Oh, so much going on. So much going on. All right. Hey, Milkweed. I'm so glad that we almost have a really great relationship. All right. Where are my cows? Oh, goodness. All right. Here's a cow right over here. Primrose is doing good. And there's Bluebell. So we've got all of everybody taken care of now. All right. There you go. All right. Thank you very much, cows. Um, Do I have any room for some cherries? I do. We'll go ahead and collect these cherries. Oh, Arugula. How are you doing, little dinosaur? Wee. Busy day. <laughs> Busy day, like every time is always so busy. All right, and let's go ahead and turn these into cheese. I've got to get out of here because we've got stuff to do. It's already super late. Oh my gosh. Got to grab these apricots. I guess I can just go ahead and sell them for now? Question mark? I should probably just put them in here. Make them into things with the cherries too. Okay. And then let's sell some of this stuff and get out of here, you guys. Because I have got picks to collect, I have got friends to befriend, I have got people to woo, I have got painful decisions to make about my romantic life. All right, and let's see. So there's the jam, there's the cheese, here's the wine, and I think that's everything to sell for now. There's a potato I can sell. I'm going to go ahead and sell that daffodil and these green beans. And I kind of need to keep some of the other stuff because horseradishes and leeks make for good gifts. All right, but I'm going to put away... 
these, and I'll keep just one horseradish for now, and one goat cheese for now. Leave the trash here. I should probably go grab my geodes since I plan on using them. Leave this here, leave this here, because I plan on going to the mines if I have time, which I'm beginning to doubt. Curses! And I need to grab my geodes because I did read that it is a lucky day today, which means that Clint should have um, some good luck cracking these open for us. Phew! All right, let's go south first so that we will be able... Do, do you come on, Roastone? So that we will be able to see what the lady with the pig is selling today. Which is another good reason to have emptied my inventory. There's a couple of fish I need to keep my eye out for. Like walleye. <laughs> keep my eye out for walleye. Oh. Oh. <gasps> Leia! Oh my gosh! Leia, hey! Hi Siri. I knew you'd be passing through here today. So I put together a surprise. It's a little picnic for us. Oh, that's so cool! This is a vegetable melody with my special spice blend. And this is a fresh salad made from greens that I forged right here in the forest. Oh no! Who will I pick? She fits me so well in so many ways. Siri, um... I just want to say thank you for helping me get one step closer to becoming a real artist. Oh, goodness gracious! <laughs> Distant voice. Well, well, well. What do we have here? <gasps> Abigail! I'm sorry! Oh, you're not Abigail. Who are you? Kel? What the heck are you doing here? Didn't you see me at the art show? I came all the way from Zuzu City to see your sculptures. And to get you to come back with me. I want things to go back to the way they were. I miss you, babe. Yuck, don't call me that. You never supported my art before. Now that I've had some success, you want me back? You make me sick. Hang in there, Leia. Hey, come here. Hey, back off. Um. Punch in the face. Try reasoning. Try reasoning? I don't think it's right to punch somebody in the face. I have nothing to say to you. Get out of my way. No. Seriously, Leia, what are you doing out here with this simple-minded bumpkin? Oh! Siri's a better person than you in every respect. Now get out of here and never come back. Leia! Oh! Let's go, Siri. I don't think Kel will be bothering us anymore. Gosh, Leia! I don't know if violence is the option. But, oh my goodness! Let's find a more secluded spot this time. Oh, gracious. Well? Well, that happened! Now I've got to pick you guys. Do I pick between Abigail, Sebastian, who kind of is like twirling around in the back of my mind, or Leia? Ah, I'm going to have to make my decision. I told myself I would give myself time until, oh, there's Jazz. Jazz, enjoy your youth. <laughs> enjoy your childhood when things are a little bit easier than this. <sighs> who am I going to pick? Who will I pick? Who should I pick? Lady with the pig, do you have anything to say for yourself? Just some stone floor, which is kind of nice, and a crispy bass, and a cave carrot. Why are you trying to sell me? Like, look at, the, look at this plum pudding. Uh, and I already have the rare seed things that, from her, um, but everything else is not worth it. An acorn for 600. Really, woman? Really? This is the way we're playing it today? Cherry bomb, crispy bass. Wow, that magnetism is actually really pretty freaking cool. But I have a magnet ring. Well, okay, you guys. Now we've had our event with Leia. So now the question is, who should I marry? I think I'm going to make that decision tomorrow. We're going to, I, I kind of want to go into the mines today. I'm just going to take my, my mind off things by going into the mines. And then tomorrow I'm going to pick who I marry. That's a huge deal. That's a really huge deal. Oh, I hope I make the right choice. Okay, do I have everything I need? I think I do. I have stuffing. I have Autumn's Bounty. Um, I should probably go back, actually. And I'm going to make a couple of root platters. Oh my gosh, no. I hope I can make it to Clint's in time. <gasps> if he closes at 3, I am going to be very, very sad. Oh boy. All right, well, let's make a couple of roots platters. Like a few of them. And let's go. And we are going to go to Clint's. Pick up my pickaxe, I really hope. And... and I have to think about this. Like, what do I sincerely, who do I feel a better connection with? Leia and I really love plants. That's actually kind of the thing, though. 
is that it really helps to be, to know that there's somebody there. Clint, my pickaxe? <gasps> my gold pickaxe, Clint, it's awesome. Oh my gosh, used to break stones, you don't say. Oh my gosh, that would be so cool. Clint, thank you. Let's process these geodes. Oh my gosh, what is that? A mudstone, that's new. Dang it, does mudstone mean that we need to go with the artist who like is really into creating things and I can totally relate to art and creation and the love of like the wild and the forest? Or does, okay, what's in this one? Copper, that doesn't really help me either way. What about in the Omni Geode? Ah, a pretty stone, a pretty stone that's a different color. Does that mean I should go with like the purple haired woman and who loves the same things about adventure as I do? Clint. I probably shouldn't ask you to advise me because, like, you're kind of lonely and a bachelor who is sad about being lonely. So I, I won't ask you and rub it in. But man. Man, I really don't know. I'm going to give myself a day to think about it. Because this is a serious decision. Let's see. Let's go ahead and here's the mudstone. It's really cool. I'll put it over here. Man. What a choice. <laughs> Oh, I really don't know who to pick. Okay, I'm gonna have to think about it. Rose Stone, you stay there for just a minute, darling. And I'm going to just go dive into the mines and forget my woes for a little bit. Come on, Pam. Let's do this. It's a little bit late in the evening to go to Calico Desert, but we're gonna pull it off anyway. Because we have a new fancy pick I want to try. Not to mention I'm supposed to feed Pierre's Notice, Top Coin, Sashimi. Uh, not meant to mention I'm supposed to- I think I'm supposed to feed this guy something? Hey, what do you want? Do you want a pumpkin, maybe? It's maw gapes at the desert sun. Even in death, it yearns for a taste. A taste of what? Not pumpkin, apparently. Hmm. There's not really anything like a watermelon. Maybe a star drop, I think that- or a melon? Like a star drop or a melon? I'll have to look into that. Alright, well, we're gonna put all this away. And I've got to make some decisions. Man, Leia, Leia or Abby? Leia or Abby? Who do I want to marry? Hmm. Hmm. All right, and let's go grab these roots platter and this miner's treat. I forgot I had all of those things. And we're going to see, put this down here, put this over here. Roots platter first? Yeah, I think the roots platter first. And then we'll save the other things as needed. This roots platter is like amazing. I am so glad we planted so many winter crops again and again and again. All right, let's do this, you guys. Oh my gosh, yes. Okay, back off, mummy. Oh my gosh, yes. There's diamonds. Okay, you need to back off. Okay, stay back. Stay back long enough for me to get the diamonds. All right, and let's see. Can I get these? Yes, look at this. Oh my gosh, my gold pick. It's so awesome. Oh dear. No, you little jerk. Okay. I don't want to have to use... Oh, why, why is he... Why is he up again? Why is he up again? He was supposed to go down after I took him down. I don't want to, like, use up my bombs so early. Hey, get, get back, get back, get back, get back. Okay, there's that. And... Let's see. Do I just need to try to wiggle my way down? Okay, darn it. Man. Oh my gosh, and look how strong these are. I think maybe I need an Iridium pick to get through these even faster. These are still pretty tough, pretty tough cookies to crack, to be honest. Oh no, here comes one of those dragon things. Maybe he'll give me the path down, though, if I destroy him. All right, let's see what about over here. There's that. All right, let's get ready to fight him. Okay, come on, buddy. No, why did I face the wrong way? <laughs> Darn! And I'm not getting down any faster. No! Curses! Oh wait! I forgot! <laughs> I can make staircases. I feel so silly now. Do they work here? They do work here, you guys! Okay, so we need to remember that. Staircases to get down into these mines. I had actually forgotten that staircases existed. So, note to self. Alright, two hits there. Oh, we can get down! Get back, get back, get back! Alright, there's that. And let's actually raid these boxes really quickly. Anything in here? Oh, there we go. An emerald. There we go. Here comes another one of the dragons. Are these the dragons that you're in for a taste? The dragons get like that big and that's why he's so big. That big, the bone dragon that's laying in the sand. All right. Ooh, what's over here? Okay, let's get these out of the way. And oh, yes, that's the way down. 
I think I'm just gonna go ahead and take it. Oh gosh, there's the other way down. I think I'm gonna go ahead and take it in just a moment here. But let's use a bomb maybe right here. Because this looks like a good spot to maybe collect up some stuff. So there's some gold. Maybe one right over here too. Come on, Omni Geodes. Darn. No, that just cleared out a bunch of stuff. But at least it gets us a lot of useful material for getting down to the next level. Ooh, that was one hit. One hit on the iron. The little iron ore spot. Okay, come on. Okay, so that destroyed him. Darn, and see, we get trapped in these little places. All right, it's already 7 p.m. I don't think we're gonna make it to level 25 tonight. Oops, well, whoa! Whoa, da-da-da-da-da-da! Get out of here! No! No! Oh, no! Well, that happened. Oh, dear. This is what I get for being distracted trying to figure out how emergency surgery. This is what I get for being distracted. 1,000 gold, two items from backpack. What did I lose? That wasn't just two items, that was my entire stack of food! Oh my gosh. All right, well, I'm gonna head home and get some good rest, you guys. There went two entire stacks of amazing piles of food. Fooey, fooey, fooey. I need to take those mines more seriously and not be so distracted. Also, in the future, I definitely need to make sure... Okay, we're just gonna, gonna limp our way home. Wait, is it the day after? No, it's still Sunday. Slime hunter just slay six red slimes. Maybe we should just stick to things that are a little bit, a little bit closer to home. He didn't even, emergency surgery and he didn't even heal us up. Are you kidding me? All right. Well, we're going to get home and just take it easy. Not do a single action or else we're going to pass out. And then I will see you guys tomorrow when I think we will have our near-death experience help us decide who we end up wanting to marry. Because I think I know what the answer is. And I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye. <sighs>